thanks for checking out my cooking channel. Today I'm going to make a beautiful, fragrant Chinese chicken dish called Dongxiang Salt Roast Chicken. Right, okay, enough of that, folks. Right, the chicken. So, Dongxiang salt roast chicken. Dongxiang comes from the central northern region of China. And I found this dish on my travels while in China. And I was so blown away by, by this little dish on a small street corner where they had some very nice wood-fired ovens. Not sure. I haven't seen much of that around China, so I'm very, very intrigued. So what it is, this is tissue paper. And as you can see, and it's soaked in oil. The Chinese use peanut oil. I'm using coconut oil, but that's my preference, you know. So it's literally saturated in the oil. Like so. And it's flavored with this beautiful, aromatic Chinese seasoning salt. Right there, look at that. This is sea salt, black pepper, dried chilies, um, cardamom, coriander seeds, star anise, cinnamon, and all dry roasted in a wok. This is the easiest and most beautiful of Chinese dishes that I absolutely adore. Take this beautiful bird and you stuff it with lemongrass, a bit of seasoning of course, inside the cavity, lashings of garlic which have been squashed and lots of ginger so all that beautiful fragrance right in there lovely so this chicken also a bit of oil more salt spice you might think quite sherlock that's a lot of salt but it does pack in all the flavor look at that Right, so I'm going to wrap this up. I love this dish. This is, I've been cooking it for years, to be, to be quite honest, you know. Right, so pack up the chicken into a little money bag, like so. And it's not quite oiled enough, so I'm going to oil it even more. Tied up with a piece of string. I think I remember in China that these folks used uh, some kind of twine. But there you go. Moving on, right? Right. Let's take this off and saturate it. This actually stops it from burning. Yep. Place it on a pan, just like so. Now I'm going to place that into my barbecue smoker. And I'm going to leave that to roast. for approximately two hours. To accompany my chicken, I'm going to make a very simple but beautiful fragrant chicken condiment, which I learned in Hong Kong the first time when I was working there in the early 1990s. And this just blew me away. It's great for all kinds of game, but particularly nice for chicken. So, lashings of ginger. This has to stay fresh on the day. Yeah, not really good for keeping over a couple of days. And the same amount of spring onions 
to ginger. Some nice touch of my Chinese salt and pepper spice, peanut oil. And that's it folks, it's as simple as that. And that has to rest for about 10-15 minutes. Let's give it a mix. Then all those flavours will infuse together. Quite simply divine that, look at that. Yeah. Oh, oh, wow. Zhao man bang yao ah. Whoa, very, very nice. Look at that. Right, let's check this chicken. Ooh. Ooh, ah. Ah. Look at that, folks. I already know when I look at this that it's ready, just from, from how the paper looks. Um, but we'll have a look with the temperature probe. But look at that. All the oils come out of that, all the flavors. It smells divine. Ah, that temperature gauge is raging right up. 60, 70, 73. That'll go pop right up to 90 degrees Celsius, which is, <laughs> you'll see it on the screen in Faraday, because I can't calculate off the top of my head. There you go, yep, that chicken's done. Right, let's have a look. Aha! Ooh! Oh, the ginger, the lemongrass, the... the oh! The fragrant herbs, the, the, the cinnamon, the star anise, that's all there, folks. Have a look at that. Now, my favourite part of any cooking sketch, as always, the tasting. Nice bit of beautiful skin for my cat. Yeah. Spring onion. Chong man pan yao ah. Oh, yiga. Fan lei Hong Kong ah. Wow, hao mei ya. Hmm, hao mei hao sik ah, hao sik ah. Da ga hao ah, pan yao da ga hao. Yes, folks. As you could probably imagine from my terrible Chinese, this is simply. Divine. Oh, yes. Winner, winner. Chicken dinner. Wow. This recipe comes from my upcoming book, The Exotic Barbecue Book, out in mid December 2018. So, folks, check it out. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel by clicking on the icon at the end of the video. And, uh, Subscribe to my social media, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Also, particularly my Chef Sherlock Facebook page, because this is where all the action happens. Thanks for watching, folks. I'm going to indulge in this and enjoy my beautiful Chinese chicken. Zhong Man Gai. Ho Sika. Thank you very much and bon appetit.